Hey Leos, so this week we've got an easy breezy week. We've not got too many planetary changes going on. In fact, actually the only big changes that we've got are to the moon. So the moon starts off the week, first few days in Aquarius, and it's gonna be conjunct Saturn, so joined with Saturn. And usually when the moon and Saturn are together, we feel a little bit more private with our emotions. We don't want to share so much with people. Uh, you know, e even if we are uh, in connection with people, we are quite reserved, you know, in our own energy. We need a little bit of time to like process our own energy by ourselves. So then midweek, we've got the moon in Pisces. So this is a more sensitive energy. You might feel a little bit more emotional or intuitive. Maybe you're getting some guidance from the universe. So then at the end of the week, the moon will be reborn into Aries. So this is like energy, motivation, inspiration, passion. Uh, and this can come out of nowhere where you suddenly feel like you've got a lot more energy than you did at the beginning of the week. So let's see what the cards have got to add. Oh, okay. So we've got the King of Pentacles and the Hierophant here. Uh, so this is suggesting that uh, you are really focused on your work or on money or on commitment at the moment. And this is uh, really about believing in yourself. It's really about believing in the path that you're on, trusting, uh, you know, taking whatever guidance you get in the week and really utilizing it in the way that suits you so this might mean that in your relationships you are really thinking about trusting your intuition rather than you know maybe listening to other people and grounding yourself grounding your energy making sure that you feel like you're doing you know your self-care you're taking care of yourself so that you can make the right decisions so hope you have a lovely week guys don't forget to, to subscribe if you want next week's forecast and if you want a reading there are links below much love